two days before Christmas, and there's a really nice, comfortable chill in the air. Will it stick around? Storm Team meteorologist James Whelan joining us live from the Town Center Mall, where you can still help with that terrific program, Toys for Tots. James. Yeah, thanks a lot, guys. Definitely been here pretty much all day since 11 o'clock. People have been coming in, making donations. We're right in front of the crate and barrel. People have been calling and asking. And look at this box full of toys. These are the type of toys you need like this right here. Look at that cool football. We need the uh, type of football and the baseball mitts for 11 to 14-year-olds. Perfect for that. That's the shortage we need. We need over 200,000. Uh, there are over 200,000 requests for toys this year, up a bunch. Of course, the hard economic times, people not donating as much, and the need a lot higher. With me right now is Shaw Heighton uh, with our big sponsor, Steingo Isco, Isco in Green. And uh, tell us what's been going on today and how are we doing so far? It's been an amazing day. The community has absolutely come out in full force. We've collected hundreds of toys um, in the same way that the firm and actually at the impetus of the employees really wanted to come out and save the day for so many kids who might otherwise not have Christmas. Um, we've just been here collecting toys. People have heard it on the station and they're coming out and just hoping that they hit that 7 p.m. mark to come out and give toys. Um, we actually had one group, a uh, wait staff from a restaurant that pulled together their tips and they brought over a hundred and twenty dollar donation um, to give direct to Toys for Tots. We met Alec earlier who gave is 10% of his allowance right. um, to Every Toys for Tots. Counts. Absolutely. It's just been um, a phenomenal day, and we're Steinger's Going Green is so proud to be a part of it and just so excited. So from Steinger and Isco and Green to the community, we're just here when you need us and so excited to be able to help out in this time of need when more people need it and there's less to go around. So. Well, great. Thanks a lot. We do appreciate everything for sure. And again, we're here just over a half an hour now. 7 o'clock is the cutoff date. We pack up these boxes and start sorting them back at the station. So uh, go ahead and come on out if you're watching us right now. Come on out. You still have a half an hour after our news ends. All right, the forecast. That's important, too. Of course, we're going into the week and cool us down to more seasonable temperatures. So we're going to be running a little bit above normal the next few days. Again, I'm out here at the town center of Boca Raton, right in front of Crate and Barrel till 7 o'clock. Come make your donation for Toys for Tots. Back to you guys.